hello this is only using transistor circuits and today i am going to talk about edge detectors and i am going to show you that how to build this circuit using one transistor and the capacitor and few resistors so an edge detector is basically a circuit that detects a rising edge or a falling edge in a square wave this is a square wave this is a some higher value high value of 5 volts or 9 volts this is low can be zero it can be generated using a switch high low high low by pressing and releasing a switch so this is a rising edge so the circuit which gives a trigger pulse at the rising edge is called positive edge detector and the circuit which gives trigger pulse at the falling edge is called negative edge detector so the circuits are important in many circuits and i felt a need of building this so i built it and i figured it out that how to make it using one transistor so this is a circuit it's very simple this is there is one transistor of npn npn transistor named bc547 common transistor its emitter is grounded led is connected to positive 9 volts so transistor is just like a valve when current flows when uh, in this direction it the valve opens and the current flows that means led gets on when the current flow in this direction that means from positive to base so here is our circuit so 10 kilo ohm um, resistor Now what I have made here is a negative edge detector. That means it will give a trigger pulse at the falling edge. This is a 10 microfarad capacitor. You can use one microfarad. You will get a shorter duration pulse. If you use 10 microfarad, you will get longer duration pulse. So right now the capacitor is charged because it's getting plus 9 volts and it's also grounded. So now the capacitor is charged. When you press the switch, not only here a uh, voltage, low voltage is developed due to this voltage divider circuit, but the capacitor also discharges as it's grounded. So the capacitor discharges and the current flows in this direction. But the transistor will not get on because the current is flowing in this direction. So when we release the switch. the capacitor charges charges and the current is flowing in this direction it charges the current flows till the capacitor is completely charged and for that amount of time the transistor is on and we see the output as a pulse as a spike it's that simple and here is the circuit made on the breadboard so i connect it nothing really happens when i disconnect there is a pulse when i connect and disconnect and if you want to build a this is a negative edge detector if you want to build a positive edge detector just connect this pull this resistor to the ground and use this resistor instead connect a switch to this resistor between the capacitor and this resistor when you connect it will give a pulse when you disconnect nothing happens when you connect it will give a pulse you saw a pulse when you connect it will give a pulse that means it is a positive edge detector and 
And for positive agitator, you have to just make few changes. You just short this and transfer this switch here. It's that easy. So if you really find my video useful, like and subscribe. Thanks for thanks for watching.